In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install SSL Certificate IIS on GoDaddy. So before we start, of course, the first thing that you would like to do is just go and open whatever browser you are going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course in your case, you can use any other browser it could be possibly working for you. Once you open that browser, make sure to go into this URL section, simply type GoDaddy dot com and hit the enter button of course that should take you into this page and if you're facing any issues with the language as i faced in my first time in this website you'll have to scroll down until the bottom of it and make sure to change the country or region which will take the or which will change the language with it of course if you want even to change the currency that will be possible so now i uh, will have to go back and log in into your account if you have one and if you don't have an account you'll have to go and create one of course you will be able to do both options at this top right corner option you will find the option to create or even log in into your account once you did one of those two options you'll find yourself on this screen which is going to be your home screen or your main screen on the Get on godaddy website so as we said in the beginning of the video is we would like to install the SSL certificates on your IIS of course and of course so once you are at this page after you logged in into your account of course you will have to of course first of all you will have to request your SSL certificate then verify it of course then download uh, the SSL and of course install it then of course you'll be able to install it on the IIS 10. And of course, you'll be able to redirect it to the HTTPS, then even you can check the installation. Of course, you can do all of this once you click here at your name, then go to my products to take you into the products page. And once you're here, you will have to scroll down a bit until you find an SSL certificate option. Of course, just go and open it up and click at manage. For me, I don't have this because I didn't take the plan of SSL certificates, but for you, you will have to do it and it will be pretty easy. So this is actually for the tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.